To make a Flourish network graph, I first need to choose the right template, which I've favorited for convenience. Now I can go to the data area to replace the sample data with my own real data about the BP group. Network diagrams usually have two sheets, one for the points or nodes and another for the links between them. I'm going to import these from two tabs in an Excel document, starting with the links. After importing, in Flourish you need to set the columns. The first two look right in this case, though we don't have a size column in this data file, so I can clear this one. Now let's import the nodes data. I'll choose the other tab in my Excel sheet, and once they're in, check the columns again. In this case, I want to change the grouping column, so I can color my visualization by column C, the incorporation year of the company. Let's also add column D to the info for pop-ups so we can make it available in the interaction. Now we go back to the preview and we can fine tune our visualization using the settings panel on the right. First, let's replace the sample data and subtitle. Or we could drop these if we prefer. Next, we can play with the different display options, such as the sizing of the nodes, and since Flourish is fully responsive, we can check how the viz will work on different device sizes. In the network graph template, the legend doubles as a filter to quickly focus in on particular areas of the network. And there are settings for things such as whether to show arrows to highlight the direction of ownership. Okay, I'm happy with this, so let's publish it so we can share it and embed it. I can do that in a few seconds up here which puts the published visualization on its own page. The published version is still interactive and fully responsive, and I can quickly grab an embed code up here to put the visualization on my own website.